Hi guys, honestly I can't express how beautiful this place is and how beautiful this country is, it's my second day here, so uh, Iceland, Iceland, uh, so first of all the, the feeling like where it's located and it's like uh, un unbelievable honestly. So uh, country number 40 for me, only a few days here, I came to Keflavik airport, it's uh, around four and a half hours flight from Poland. I had flight from Poland, Krakow. Mm. Uh, I rented the car in the airport uh, briefly because a lot of people asking about the prices. So it's quite expensive here in uh, Iceland. They rent a car, the smallest car I got, like 85 euro per day, like the cheapest hotel, like around 80 euro per night. And uh, definitely you, you need a car here because without car you can't get around and also the taxis like are quite expensive from airport to the city is like hundred dollars for the taxi so uh, definitely the car is a very good idea look at this beauty so this is my first location first destination and uh, I'll visit also the blue lagoon so I'll be here for two days I'll visit like the top top five six destinations and uh, even the joy just driving the car with these views with the nice music it's just unbelievable experience also the interesting point because now the winter the sun is only sunrise around 11 o'clock so now it's a 11 is a sunrise 10 o'clock a.m in the morning it was still dark and uh, it's my first day today yesterday came late night and uh, they say in the sunset the sunset is around three o'clock and it's getting dark around four o'clock so the sun is only around four hours four five hours maximum during the day so guys let's explore together like subscribe comment and uh, i would say iceland for me it's uh, one of the countries that i wanted to visit for a long time and when i arrived here i honestly i like i couldn't believe that i'm here standing in iceland so guys see ya Okay, a little bit of history of Iceland. Here is uh, like a small museum on the side. Iceland, by the way, they, it has a very long history for thousands of years. Imagine when this cold weather. Very interesting. So at the moment we are this uh, Thingvellir National Park. Thingvellir. Okay, let's see. Short history. Yeah. <laughs> 
80 100 gradi fede guys another tourist attraction is called geyser it's the natural the water is boiling water 100 degrees
amazing place, Blue Lagoon. So this was the place where I came uh, first uh, evening when I arrived from the airport. It was close already, dark. And uh, then I checked online to book the swimming in the lagoon. It cost uh, for three hours 89 euro and for a whole day it's 100 euro. But everything was booked for next three or four days. So I wasn't able to get a ticket. But otherwise, if you visit an island, Iceland, this is one of the top places to visit and you should book in advance. Amazing experience and especially during daytime when it's still light. Now we have around 4.30 p.m. So if you're going in the evening, the best time around 12 or 1 p.m. when there is a sun, amazing experience.